A dramatic two-year-old finale of Supernatural was soon revealed and a spin-off was soon revealed. Jensen Ackles, who played Dean Winchester for 15 years, is now returning to tell a whole new story, but this time around, we'll learn more about his parents before the yellow-eyed demon killed their mom. Stick around to find out what the creator of the show has in store for its fans. First up, a new Winchester's been cast. Tom Welling has joined the cast of the Winchesters as Samuel Campbell, Sam and Dean's grandfather. The Winchesters, set in the 1970s, would chronicle Uncle Sam and Dean's parents, John Winchester and Mary Campbell, as they begin their fatal romance and go on monster hunts. Mary's father was previously portrayed by Mitch Pileggi in Supernatural seasons 4 and 6. Although the yellow-eyed demon Azazel killed Samuel in 1973, he was revived in the 21st century by the demon Crowley and spent some time hunting with Sam Winchester, his younger brother. Welling's casting as Sam and Dean's grandfather Samuel Campbell was officially announced at the New York Comic Con. The four former Smallville star will play a younger Samuel than the one Supernatural viewers know from season 6, but he'll probably share the Winchester Patriarch's affection for his daughter Mary and skepticism with the earlier edition. Next up, what can we expect from Tom Welling's Samuel Campbell? In the television series Supernatural, Mary Campbell's father was a tough, no-nonsense, anti-social hunter who had an unexpectedly dark edge and a complex connection with his family. Even though his main goal was to protect his daughter and other innocent people, Sam and Dean didn't always agree with the way he did things. The best aspects of Welling's prior performances in Samuel's background might be combined in his portrayal of the character, which would make Samuel more relatable to viewers. Given that the focus of the series is on Mary and John's relationship, Welling might also adopt Samuel's cynicism towards others in a break from his normal roles. The stern father might disapprove of his daughter's new boyfriend and make things difficult for the young couple. Welling is a great addition to the core cast of the eagerly anticipated prequel series The Winchesters, as one of the first big-name CW stars. The CW is attempting to make up for the loss of the well-liked property Supernatural after the series finale by turning the series into a new franchise for the network with the prequel. When The Winchesters premieres this month on the network, they may have success in their hands thanks to Welling's involvement in Ackles' reprisal of his role. Not to mention, what does Jensen have to say about the spinoff? Many characters might be preparing to return after the release of The Winchesters. The CW series ran for 15 seasons, with a diverse range of human and super supernatural characters. Jensen Ackles, the show's creator, hasn't given any specifics about who viewers might anticipate seeing, but he hasn't ruled out the idea of a few returns either. There are plenty of options to bring back some fan favorites in the Winchesters because there are so many characters to pick from. There are no restrictions on the characters who could return for the Winchesters as the prequel has already retold a portion of supernatural history. The original series was good at reimagining old favorites and the change in timeline gives the show some creative freedom in terms of who might be involved. When interviewed with TV Line, Ackles added that he has a lot of creative freedom because there is absolutely nothing off the table. The show has given them several abilities to help bring back a character, and the actors who played them may very well return. Coming up, could Bobby also return for the spinoff? Bobby Singer making a comeback in the Winchesters wouldn't be out of place for sure. In fact, Bobby is a likely ally for the young couple when they face monsters together because he was John Winchester's hunting partner and comrade back in the day. Bobby was frequently brought back from the dead in Super Supernatural to help with the Winchester family with their work, so it wouldn't be out of the question to have him appear in the prequel. But fans will have to stick it up because Jim Beaver may not be able to return. The show follows the monster hunting crew in the 70s and everyone was younger back then. A new actor will probably be cast to play Bobby. If fans are lucky, we may get a glimpse of the actor in the fan favorite role. However, fans should be happy that they'll get to see a younger, happier Bobby, who may have once smiled while his wife was still alive. While we may not see the familiar face, we may get to explore a side of the man that we or the Winchester brothers have yet to see. Next up, could Castiel make an appearance? Castiel would be welcomed back as one of the Winchester's greatest allies and a beloved character from Supernatural. Despite the lack of official confirmation, Misha Collins has made it clear that he is interested in Castiel appearing on the Winchesters. Collins has expressed his interest in joining the show by tweeting how a trench coat wearing angel with the ability to time travel could probably help. He also tweeted other cryptic things, speaking about how things never really end. Fans don't know whether to brush it off as a joke or take the tweet seriously as a sign of his involvement in the spinoff. The truth is that his return is possible. He's an angel who can pop up whenever and wherever he wants, and maybe we'll learn that he has more in common with the Winchesters than he revealed. There are a lot of possibilities. Moving on, let's not forget some other important members of the team. Ellen Harville, played by Samantha Ferris, a longtime friend of John Winchester, may also appear in the Winchesters. Ellen told the boys that John was like a family once, despite the fact that 
fact that he kept their history private. In their younger years, the trio, along with Ellen's spouse, Bill Harville, worked as hunters together, which could be explored in the prequel. Ellen would be an intriguing pick to bring back for the Winchesters because there's still so much unknown about her and John's past. Even though the Winchesters are retelling the love story of John and Mary, Azazel, the demonic being with the yellow eyes, is essential to the plot. According to the original storyline, John was inspired to go hunting, and the events of Supernatural were launched as a result of Mary dying at Azazel's hands. It would only make sense for Azazel to appear in the Winchesters since he was one of the first Supernatural villains and had the demonic ability to switch between human vessels at leisure. Jack, played by Alexander Calvert, who assumed the role of God after Supernatural, might also make an appearance. Before the prequel's release, a few fan theories about Jack were already circulating, one of which was that Jack had given John and Mary a second chance at love. Even if this might just be wishful thinking, it would explain why Supernatural's portrayal of John and Mary's background differs from the Winchester's version of events. The spin-off's announcement was met with a rocky beginning. The fact that Jared Padalecki was unaware of a new Supernatural prequel series called The Winchesters gutted him. Since the 2005 premiere of the long-running drama, Padalecki has played Sam Winchester for 15 seasons. Eric Kripke, the series creator and first showrunner, had originally only planned for three seasons, but later increased that number to five with the idea that season five would wrap up the primary plotline and mark the end of Kripke's showrunning duties. However, due to the show's immense success, it ran for a further 10 seasons before finally ending in 2020. Kripke seemed to be aware of the spinoff because his tweets not only congratulated Jensen Ackles on the announcement, but also told fans how much he loved the idea when it was first pitched. Padalecki, on the other hand, was completely unaware of the news. He took to Twitter to congratulate Ackles almost passive-aggressively. Dude, I am delighted for you. I wish I heard about this some other way other than Twitter. When a fan probed him to ask if he was joking about not knowing, he added, no, it's not. This is the first I've heard about it. I'm gutted. Next, have things cooled down between Sam and Dean? But there's no bad blood between the two friends today, according to Padalecki. While he stated that both of them wish they had dealt with the matter differently, things have cooled down. He added that there's no time to think about who to blame for the mess or what happened in the days following the news. Padalecki also added that he would always be ready to help out with telling the Winchester story whenever he was needed. He assured fans that there's no one who could be happier for Jensen Ackles than he is, but whatever he says, the announcement seems to have made the friendship between the two a little rocky. That's a wrap for today's video. Are you excited to see the spinoff? If so, which character would you most like to see return from the Supernatural series? Let us know in the comments below. And until next time, thanks for watching.